What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, I'm gonna be showing you guys a few plank variations today. This could actually be a short workout that you could add to the end of your regular workout. So it's a little bit of core work. So I kind of wanted to just show you guys some plank variations that I like and that are pretty challenging, but you can uh, tone them down a little bit if you are not ready for the exact variation that I'm giving you. So I just wanted to get on here and take you guys through this core work. Um, it's, I think it will be great to add to the end of any workout. If you wanna hit some core, let's get after it. I hope you guys enjoy it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel for some more videos. But I'm gonna get after this. I'm gonna show you guys each variation that I'm gonna be doing, and then, um, We'll, I'll go through the whole thing and you guys can give it a try. Okay guys, so I think it'll take about five minutes. Um, so first we are gonna be doing a regular plank. Um, you can do this on your elbows or on your hands. And then um, we're gonna do that for a minute. And then next we'll have side planks. Uh, we'll do 30 seconds for each side. And then a plank walk up which can be done on a staircase or a box or a chair, whatever you have. We're gonna do a 10 starting with each arm. So you'll have a total of 20 and then Copenhagen plank, we're gonna do 30 seconds for each side like we did the side planks and then plank twists. Um, we'll do 10 each side for those as well. So um, I'm gonna go through these and show you guys how to do them but I will get after this and I hope you guys enjoy. Okay guys, so the first plank that we have is a regular plank. Like I said, you can do it on your elbows or you can do it on your hands. So just make sure whenever you're doing the plank that you stay straight all the way across your body. Um, don't TP your butt and um, don't sag too much. Just keep a tight core the whole time. I'm gonna do a regular plank just on my elbows so like this but you can also do it like this if that's what you're more comfortable with so there's the first one all right next we're going to have side planks so we're going to do 30 seconds each side like i said um, so once again if you don't feel comfortable doing it on your elbow you can do it on your hand um, i just recommend that you offset your feet you don't stack them um, so we'll be like this and you can have your hand on your hip or your hand up whatever makes you feel the best and uh, like I said engage your core don't let yourself sag down keep it tight and lifted and then we'll do the other side um, 30 seconds for each side okay next we're gonna do a plank walk up um, so I'm gonna use this box, but you can also use the first step of a set of stairs. Um, that would be a good way to do it. Or um, if you're not able to do this, you can just go ahead and do a second regular plank, or you can um, just do a plank and alternate tapping your shoulders. So this is what this will look like. I'm gonna be up in a plank on my hand and I'm gonna go that's one, and then we'll switch sides. That's one for the other side, and we're gonna do 10 for each arm. So 10 times for each arm that is starting. So we'll just give that a go, and that's how you do those. All right, so now we have the Copenhagen plank. So for this one, if you do not have a box, or if you're not at the gym, you can easily use a chair or your couch, um, whatever you're comfortable with, or you can even use something lower than that. But what you're gonna do is be on one arm and you're gonna get this leg up. And this is how you're gonna hold this plank. And we're gonna do 30 seconds for each side, just like we did the side planks. 
So you're really engaging your core on the side and this um, inner thigh. So we're gonna do each side for 30 seconds, like I said, and that is a Copenhagen, a, a Copenhagen plank. All right, and for the last one, we are going to do plank twists. So we're gonna do 10 each side. You're just gonna get in the plank position and you're gonna rotate your hips each side and back to the center. So we'll do 10 each side, but this is how it will look. You'll just go back and forth until you get a total of 20. So um, count your reps, but that's what we have. So I'm gonna get after it and you guys can get after it too. So you can go ahead and follow along with the video. I'm gonna get started.
Okay guys, so I just finished up. It took me a little over five minutes. I think it was like five minutes and 45 seconds or something like that. So you guys can easily throw this in at the end of a workout just to get a little extra core work in and a little bit of a burn. Um, I think that it went really well. Um, the only thing I do suggest is that if you're using a box for a Copenhagen plank, make sure that you have a towel or something that can cushion your knee um, that's resting on the box. So um, I think that's all that I have. Um, I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you guys get after this. Um, if you enjoyed this, don't forget to like it and also leave a comment if you tried it out. Um, also, don't forget you can send it to a friend and have them try it out. So um, I just want to thank you guys for watching. Thanks for coming back to the channel. I will be posting another video next week, so stay tuned for that. Um, if you guys want to see anything specific, let me know in the comments and I will get it out there. So once again, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in the next one.